A question of character. The average bandicoot is a nocturnal marsupial, appearing at night to feed, avoiding dangerous predators. But not this bandicoot. This bandicoot is insane, coming out whenever he wants and killing. Turtle! Crash is a gene-altered bandicoot standing at five feet, whereas the average bandicoot does not stand at all. He does not have pants or shoes. Crash has both as well. Crash has the face of a commando general, kind of. Dr. Neocortex. Dr. Neocortex created an army of evil animals and the Cortex Vortex, but it is Portex. Dr. Cortex failed morphing Crash into general of his Cortex commandos, an army of irreverent and ugly beasts. Ripper Roo, Koala Kong, Papu Papu, and Dr. Nitrous Brio, his cautious but equally evil assistant. Crash escapes, but Tona doesn't. Another bandicoot, Dr. Neocortex, has gene altered, but with the sexy attributes. Crash must rescue Tona. He begins on Insanity Beach. Perfect. Because Crash is insane. Turtle! Crash is beamed to many dangerous island locations, searching for the way to beam out. But before this, he must crash. Crash does not know much, only that he can destroy. Die Crab! Crash performs a violent spin attack, displaying multiple blurred heads and blurred fists, leaving only the blur of his enemy. Smack. Crash also uses the hop and smack. Hop your head. Smack you up. The natives have no chance. Crash collects delicious wumpa fruit from crate boxes. 100 of them allow for another Crash life form. Crash possesses the power of resurrection. Excellent, because Crash will die multiple times. Crash has blue jeaned shorts and tennis shoes, but is topless, so he must never be touched. Crash yelps loudly whenever injured, exclaiming, whoa. Crash must take care around explosive TNT. It destroys his body, leaving grotesque charred remains and his gigantic eyeballs. Crash must use animalistic ingenuity to outsmart the stupid. He kills Ripper Roo with big TNT and Koala Kong with big rocks. Exclamation boxes allow Crash to uncover location area secrets that Shut destroying up. all boxes in a particular area provides Crash with riches. A priceless gem. Crash also picks up other things. Some things that are his face. Another life. Some things that are other faces. The masks of Witch Doctor Aku Aku. Spirit protector of the islands. Allowing Crash protection against monkey touch. Snake bites. I am fireproof. If Crash Crash collects three Aku Aku masks. He becomes invincible, having the power to battle. Yes! Crash does not understand his own tricks. Thankfully, Crash has awesome maneuverability. Excellent. Because the three islands of Australia can prove incredibly frustrating. When upon the river, come on, I was on top of that. Crash will, ah! Okay, okay, made it, okay. Now Crash, no! but Crash will persevere, fighting the fearsome Cortex Commandos, no matter their strength or butt crack, navigating through the treacherous lands with precise jumps and trying to make it over this stupid bridge. Power, excellent. Crash's spin is an ultimate attack and his Aku Aku invincibility is even more ultimate. The only thing that can make Crash stronger is a gun, but he already kind of has that. Defense, moderate. The only element saving Crash from a low defense rating is the Aku Aku mask, which is so strong that it can deflect bullets. But Crash is so weak that he cannot even stand the mere fish, but for some reason can fall from over 50 feet and remain okay. Agility. Excellent. Crash amazingly hops throughout the river in Dr. Neo Cortex's base and on this bridge. Oh! Grade B. Crash is certainly a world class commando, regardless of his confused appearance and a look of uncertainty. But it is certain that Crash will defeat Dr. Neo Cortex and rescue Tana, especially after he begins to hear the sound of the beam transporting gull, knowing that all he has to do is. God, I quit. Next episode. You can't have your showroom 
until you have your kin. Quest with me, learn with us, enrich your mind, empower your inquiry, like our material, subscribe to our page, put character into question, return every Monday for more. A question of character.